eyes are for a chameleon the most important sensory organ. Thanks to the eyes, the chameleons gain the majority of information they need for their survival. The other sensory organs are in comparison to the eye not well developed and not well functional. The chameleon eyes are probably the most developed eyes in animal reign and have a very special anatomy and very special function. They are extremely movable, they are capable of seeing for short distance, for long distance and they are even capable of zooming. The eyes also are giving information about the status of the animal. Completely different eyes we can see in chameleons which are sleeping, in chameleons which are waking up, in chameleons which are active, or in chameleons which are ill or dehydrated, or even in eyes of chameleon which is dying. The chameleon eyes also take part in complex behavioral processes, like here when the male imposes a female using special movements of the head and special movements of the eyes. And special eye movements are also made during the actual mating process. In captivity, we need to pay special attention to eyes of the chameleons, because same as in the wild nature, they are important indicators and they are vital for the survival of the chameleons in the wild and in captivity. In captivity, we unfortunately see very often eye diseases. Some of them are real eye diseases caused by bacteria or fungi without our influence, but most of them are actually potentiated by wrong captivity parameters. The germs are more likely to attack the eye holes in case of wrong supplementation, too high temperature, too high humidity or dust and dirt in the cage. Chameleons shed quite often their old skin and a small piece of skin or a dirt can of course be also a reason for an eye irritation. In the case that the problems with the eyes are long term or heavy, it is a call for a specialist for a veterinary doctor and not for an amateur. Sometimes even eye flushing is necessary, but there is also one more trick that you can try before you call for a vet. Our chameleon started to have problems with his eyes. It started in Italy, but gradually his eyes was more and more clouded with milky jelly. I consulted all husbandry permanenters with experts and we found out that I do not make any obvious mistake anywhere and that there is no apparent cause of this condition, perhaps only possible contamination of the cajective sac with some dirt. In such a case, the normal recommendation is go to the veterinary doctor. However, there is one more trick that you can try and it might work. The trick is to use the chameleon's ability to clean their own eyes. It is an inborn procedure that looks sometimes horrible, in which the chameleons, with a strange movement of eyes bulging them out, try to clean their eyes. This way they clean the sp- space between the lid and the eye, the conjunctive sac, and in the nature it actually happens a natural way. However, in captivity we can induce it. In order to design the process the most quick and most careful way towards the chameleon, we need to prepare some stuff. You need simply a twig, you need a spray bottle and you need about one liter, it means quarter of gallon, of physiological solution. This solution you can buy in the pharmacy or you can prepare it very simply at home in dissolving one teaspoon of salt in quarter of gallon of cold water. This physiological solution is then to be given to the spray bottle and you need to spray on the chameleon somewhere in the bathtub, for instance, from the distance of about two to four inches directly into his face. You need to do it in a way that the chameleon feels a certain discomfort so that the water enters the injective sac and the chameleon starts to clean its eyes. 
please beware not to use other than physiological solution. Don't use the normal bathtub water because this water is hypotonic and it could irritate the eyes and the conjunctive sac and it could be then a more susceptible for other diseases or other germs. When I did this procedure for the first time, I was really afraid that the chameleon would not be too stressed, but we managed it. This procedure is quite effective and in some of the light cases this can be what fixes the issue with the eye. In this case this eye flushing method was very successful, however after finishing it, after several days the chameleon started again to have some troubles with the eye and this is why we have solved the situation together with the veterinary doctor. He inspected the chameleon and prescribed the disinfection eye drops of Talmoseptonex and the eye cream Vita POS. Several applications of the eye cream were very successful and after it the chameleon started to see same as before. Now we are very happy that after all this nature treatment the chameleon is creasing well again and it is as active and as cool as before. Please remember you need to really care for the eyes of the chameleons in captivity. If something happens, you know what to do. But much better than to solve a problem is to do prophylactics. To prevent the eye problems in captive chameleons, you must first provide the correct husbandry parameters, especially temperature and humidity. Second, you must provide proper terrarium design, specifically pay attention to ventilation. Third, you must provide proper lighting, especially focused on white light and UV, not too weak and not too strong. Fourth, you need to provide environment free of dust and dirt. And fifth, you must provide proper supplementation, especially focus on daily bee pollen and on administration of vitamin A. Remember, the life of chameleons is dependent from the health of their eyes. Stay tuned.